Hello and thanks for watching. So ever since my last video, I worked on new game features, shop system, UI, and main menu. So the first thing that I worked on was called the pillow. Basically what this is, is that the pillow shields the character once from the incoming meteors. I actually wanted to implement a cool looking force shield, but I thought the pillow was somewhat unique, so I left it as it is. You can see that in the original development, you actually have a force shield around you. And it actually shielded you uh, once from the incoming meters, just like how the pillow did. Then the next feature that I developed was, well, I don't have a name for this yet, but every few distance, everything is suddenly sped up by a notch. As a result, it imposes a greater challenge for you to maneuver through the space and survive as long as you can. After I developed these two features, the gameplay seemed pretty good for now. You have two types of meter obstacles, a sudden change in speed, challenge I guess, and a pillow to save your life. The next thing I worked on was the shop system. I first drafted a concept art for it, where you can scroll horizontally to get items for purchase, and buttons for player information on the top. I then developed the UI in Unity. It took a bit of time to figure out how to lay out a scalable item slots with a mask on top, but I was able to make one in the end. Then I created a button for shop and inserted some quickly drawn characters as you see here. We got a blue and grey colored spaceship and a cat with a light blue eyebrow. <laughs> anyway, after you click your desired character, your character in-game uh, changes accordingly. Afterwards, you can now see the amount of coin you currently have. Uh, then you can purchase your desired item with a buy button and you can see that you have obtained the item and can equip it. I also added a state where once you have purchased the item, that item is no longer selectable. Alright, after I developed the shop system, I started to work on the UI. I created a card where the item and its information can be laid out. Moreover, the circular button on the right hand corner will be red if the item is not equipped, and it will turn blue if the item is equipped. Then I created two type of cards, where one will be a purchasable item, and the other will be an unlockable item. After the UI was drawn, I implemented the images in the game. I think I'm going to have to spend more time reviewing the shop UI, but this is what I have for now. Before I show you the fully functioning shop system, I also worked on the main menu background and buttons.
and this is currently the finished version of the main menu. I couldn't decide whether to remove the characters on both left and right hand side, but I wanted to show the players that the cat you're playing as is trying to rescue other cats who are stranded in space. After I finished the main menu art, I implemented them into the game. And lastly, this is the finished version of the main menu. You can click play from the main menu and the game will start. Moreover, you can click unlock button and the shop will appear. Now, I forgot to add the buy button, so I'm going to work on that right now. Um, but for now, you can click on the item, purchase it and see the uh, equipable circular button on the top corner of the item as well. And in the next video, I hope to show you the releasable version of the game, so stay tuned.